Hello and welcome to Musings by Amit. My name is Amit Patel and you are watching the live show Musings with Software Engineers. Uh, Shubhra Jyoti Poddar. Hi Shubhra Jyoti. Uh, I joined as a fresher in Tech Mahindra in 2014. But due to family issue, I left the job in 2016. Guide me how to get a job back into IT. Okay, so Shubhra, uh, 2016 to four years. Okay, uh, I would suggest that for someone like you, because there is a four year gap, okay, go for some technology where there are less employment so there are less employees for example data science okay there are a lot of data science graduates required data science engineers required but there are less number of real data science engineers available okay so you do a proper certification in data science okay i'm just giving you an example you can do this with java programming you can do this with python programming you can do this with dot net programming you can do this with anything okay but you learn something which is current and something go to the so so let's say you are a programmer in java so in java what is happening today go to few job description check in the job description what all do they require and or do one certification which will prove that you now know everything that is required for this you did this certification and then be confident that somebody will give you a job be ready to start at the experience of a fresher because that is what that can happen you should be ready to start as a fresher it may happen that people will put you as a fresher okay but after that, if you start working really well, then you will start growing because of your experience and just overall general experience of yours. Okay, so first thing is to do some kind of a certification, which will give you an edge over all the software engineers today, because whatever you have learned is too old. Now things have changed and try to get into fields which are very, uh, which need a lot of people. For example, cybersecurity, uh, cloud computing, okay, uh, cloud management, DevOps, or uh, uh, internet of things, or uh, you can go into data science, artificial intelligence, uh, machine learning. You can go into uh, robotic process automation. You can go into Selenium and uh, quality control uh, automation. So you can go into these various fields where it is difficult to get into, get a, some kind of a certification, really work hard towards learning these things, use the formula of three, that is read, re repeat and rehearse. In this video, I've explained what it means. Okay, read, repeat and rehearse, and then uh, get, then, then start applying for jobs. Okay, and be confident that you will get a job. Be ready. If somebody says you will get this experience and this salary, start somewhere. After that, you can become better. Don't even expect people will take your two years of experience. Okay. If you're really good in communication, if you're really good in talking, then people can even accept that experience. But chances are people will say, Oh, uh, I think you don't have the experience. And you don't need to fight. You don't need to argue. Just accept it that it's OK. I'm going to start and I'm going to work hard and I'm going to be better within the next three to five years and I'm going to put everything in place. OK, so you can do that and you can get back into IT even after a gap of four years. Uh, it should not be a problem. OK, it's all about thinking about what you want to do and then start doing it, taking action towards that.
I'm going to link all the videos that I've talked about in this video. Uh, the program that I've talked about, A Players, is also in the description of this video. At the end screen, you will see some video. You can go and watch that video. So you can subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you get all the updates.